So I just wanted to show, you know, I was talking about this in the last video. This does work in the corner, but the problem is when you do this in the corner, this is actually, it hits that um, 18 frames, right? Instead of uh, 21 to 22. So that's why I said, theoretically, this would be very hard to do in a real match. I'm sure most people would not be able to do that, but it is showing that Yes, you can, you know. Does Vegito have no corner pressure whatsoever? Well, technically he does, you know what I mean? Because we've seen that this does work in the corner and if the guy ever tries to get out, theoretically you can, every time you see the homie dash start, vanish or level three, right? Then of course, if the opponent starts trying to reflect out of it, well, we've already seen if they reflect, you know what I mean? We've seen the pressure, the bug can happen, whatever. So um, the idea that Vegito has no corner pressure is, is not true at all because all this shit, well, I mean, if you have fast reflexes, you can just keep on doing this over and over again because whenever the opponent tries to get out, you know what I mean? You can counter them. And maybe that's why this one guy was trying to say that this Banshee Blast is only zero or minus one because they were doing it in the corner. So yeah, when you do it in the corner, it can be minus one or minus zero, depending on the spacing, right? So we would want it to be, as long as you are at zero, as long as you do one that is at zero, if you do a jab, your jab will generally be higher than any character. Because if they try to jab, well, you're right there and their jab's going to miss you, so your jab will hit them. And if they do a too hard slash, whatever, they will miss you as well. You'll be able to block in time. So the idea that Vegito has no corner pressure is not true, right? It's just that, well, fuck, people aren't even doing any of this in the first place, right? So, um, so yeah, I just wanted to show, you know, that does work in the corner, but like I said, mid-screen, and you can't do the vanish install in the corner because it just hits too fast, right? So when you're in the corner, you have to time it, right? But again, like I showed, it hits at 18 frames, so it's, uh, if it was just you reacting to something, that's, that's not too bad, but you gotta remember, you're, depending on what they do, you're pressing different buttons, so it could be, that's why I say this is, you know, would I go for it in a real match? Yeah, I would. I would. <laughs> but, uh, you know what I mean? Uh, would I hit it? I don't know. Every time, consistently, I would have to be on my game. But some other stuff I want to show is, and I've showed this off very early with him as well, is that, remember, or let me get here in the first place, remember that you can't too hard slash that or whatever. You can't too hard slash that or this. So they have to hold the vanish besides reflect. And we've already told reflecting is dangerous because you have to delay your timings and it just depends on what movie he's doing, changes the reflecting timing. And if he does a sassy kick, well, fuck, you're at the advantage again. So he just starts all over because of the bug I showed, right? So when you're in the corner as well, he has this kind of stuff, right? And this is deceptively, this is actually, of course you have the regular kind of mind games of whatever I'm doing, right? Who knows what I'm doing? Am I gonna jump back? Am I instant air dash or whatever? But Vegito actually has kind of an ABC kind of thing he can even do that not a lot of other characters actually have access to because of how his normals work. So if we go to, where are we? Um, recording settings? So which one is he at here? Let's see. Okay, so if he's gonna do that jab, and this is what I'm trying to show like an ABC kind of thing, right? Well, if I do jab, you know what I mean? Well, that's what happens. Trade. What if I try medium? Oh, I get hit. What if I try too hard? Oh, well, he's not in range. Hmm. Okay. And the thing is normally, and of course there, there are some character specifics for this as well, but normally, when you're in this kind of range from that, the way that Vegito falls is the medium is actually generally the option. But as you saw, depending on the spacing, you know what I mean? So jab basically beats the medium, but the hard beats the light and the too hard slash whatever, right? So if we saw that, and again, there are some character specificity, specific ideas that I'll show, but then if we do here, what is he doing here? So if he does that, well, it's not in range. 
If I try medium, might block it that time. I missed. He blocked, I tried green. I got hit. Hmm. So this is actually deceptively actually pretty good. Besides the normal, oh, you blocked an instant air dash, whatever. Because of Vegito's hard slash, or hard is so big, and his jab, there's actually a little bit of an ABC. Generally speaking, like I said, medium is what you do to beat the hard with characters. But as you saw, that can even lose there. And so then let's go, let's look at something like Frieza, right? Where we're getting into like character specific things. So we do Frieza, right? This is what he's doing. Remember, you can't too hard slash through this, right? So again, we're going to try to jab. I get hit. Try to medium. I get hit. Try to too hard. He blocks in time. Or we just try to break him. I get hit. So you're like, wow, that's actually deceptively quite a bit better than you think. And again, there's actually character specific stuff to this. So then you're like, well, how would you beat that? And you're like, fireball. And this gets into something kind of weird about this game, right? That I don't see people actually talk about the game on this level. When you block the homing, and again, I haven't seen anyone talk about the game to this level. But again, I know what I showed. I showed with Goku and Frieza that I basically am just fucked, right? Basically, whatever I'm trying to do, I'm kind of fucked for the first place, right? But again, generally, there's like an ABC, right? The hard beats um, everything besides the medium. Generally speaking, I know that's not what I showed. I just serendipitously happened to time this quite well that it's beating the mediums as well. But generally, hard beats everything besides the stand medium for characters, right? And then that's why you have the jab mix up, right? And that's, again, again, this is besides the normal kind of, you know, oh, am I doing this? You know, I don't have to do that. I could just do Banshee Blast, whatever. So Vegito has some access to this. And a lot of this stuff actually, you know, it works, you know, mid-screen too. You know what I mean? It's not only in the corner per se. And so a lot of characters actually, it's kind of weird. A way to get out of this is you fireball because it just beats everything else if you actually time this correctly. Weird shit, right? So that's kind of a weird meta of this game that I've never seen talked about that you can actually, some characters have the way that they hit a homing dash, no matter what normal you do because of the rock, paper, scissors of this game, they technically can win unless you do something weird, right? So serendipitously enough, a lot of characters' best counters to this is actually a fireball. And I want to show something else weird too, because this actually then shows off a bug, right? That you can do. So normally this move doesn't have a lot of uses anti-air wise, right? But there is one kind of ghetto use it has. It kind of is a ghetto cross-up anti-air. So if we're doing this... Did you see that? So if he were to try to attack or do some kind of instant air dash or back dash, mix up whatever, lightsaber beats it. And if he goes for an instant air dash mix-up, he gets hit. Now remember, when you do it this way, a bug happens in the game and you can't hit the guy, right? So if I were to do... Oh, believe this one. He's not going to get hit, right? Damn, it's almost... Can you imagine if I played this game? But here's some of Then that hits. So that's kind of a weird use for that move, and I know I'm getting really deep into layers of this game in ways that people don't talk about this game, but I just wanted to show that's possible. So, you know, showing off some things, you know, you can react to any homie dash, whatever. It's in 18 frames. It's quick, so, you know what I mean? It's uh, in a real match, it would be hard, but, you know, if the guy tries to get out of it, you level three them, whatever, they got to hold it. And I showed this before very early on in the game, that Vegito is a character that can actually use the ABC of this game because his hard actually hits far enough that that's actually kind of surprisingly sort of real besides the normal just, well, I got to decide mix up kind of thing. Just deciding between a jab or a hard. If you space it off these setups that are safe, because if you're too close, See, the heart is too close right there, right? That won't work. That will not work on most characters. He's too close, jab is going to hit him, heart is going to hit him. But, serendipitously enough, you can space it where Orb 
is safe to the homing dash, and then their attack is not in range to be able to hit you. Do you get what I'm saying? Anyway, remember if you like the videos, like, sub, silly, comment, share, support the channel. Um, thanks.